Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. Hope everyone is well. It's time for the weekly top and bottom of the deck. I apologize for not being able to get it done yesterday. Um, after I did the Aries reading, I was just completely fried. I tried to do Leo like three times. It's just, you know what? We're not. We're not going to get anything else accomplished in tarot today. So... Um, unfortunately, this one will have to be by the elements. It will not be in all signs because of time constraints. So if it doesn't resonate with your sun, check in when rising your Venus placement. If you're not sure what those are, everything will be listed in the description box below with the timestamps. So without further ado, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and be vice versa. So on, so forth. You guys know the drill. So... If you're new here, I think we might vibe. You can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. If you're returning, welcome back. Glad to see you. Anybody can hit the like button at any time if you so choose. It would be super cool. It all helps the channel. It all helps the video to be circulated to those who might need the message. So without further ado, we're going to invoke the cards and get started. Heavenly Father, Mother, with Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for the collective, the Fire Sign Tarot this week. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given, and I ask that you help me use it to bring the collective to their highest possible spiritual good and them on their highest possible spiritual path. Okay. Water Signs. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Oh, goodness. I'm being argued with. Holy cow. Let's try that again. A little better. Two more. Ace of Wands, the challenge being the Ace of Swords reversed. Okay. Hmm. That's a conflict, let me tell you. You want it? the match is striking, it's lit. There's interference. Hmm. All right. Give me the events. Oh, shoot. Interference might be a blessing, y'all. Y'all still healing from something. Possibly there's something coming back. Seven of Swords. Mm, seven of Wands reversed. I don't like that. We're going to get a clarifier on that. Why? Why is it happening? Judgment reversed, lovers reversed, nine of swords. Uh huh. Yup. Water signs. There was a disconnect, it consumed you. I think you tried to bury it, but it consumed you. There's a new opportunity, there's a new match being struck, but you're still healing. Something coming back, trying to reclaim what it thinks it's theirs. There's divine intervention here with this Ace of Swords reversed. What's the outcome in the make a break outcome? 
Two of Cups, make a brick. Strength. Bottom of the deck, Empress reversed. Eek. Eek. Okay. Can I get clarity spirit? Clarity for water signs? Just a little. We need a lot. We need a lot. Ace of Swords reversed. Just one. Just one. Okay, give me three. King of Cups, Seven Swords, and the Lovers. And this is the uh, in between tarot, so it's like double the energy. King of Cups into the Page of Cups. The emotion isn't worn, but it's there. Seven of Swords into the Eight of Swords. Lovers into the Chariot. This feels like divine intervention. <sighs> I'm just going to throw this out there. Every once in a while, the universe does this. When you ask for something, oh, I want this person to come back, sometimes they come back at the worst possible time, or when you think you're done with them and you're ready to move on, they come back. It's just, it's, it's a divine timing thing. I think that's what this is, but it's divine timing with a purpose. You haven't healed yet. Whatever this was kept you consumed for a long time, and I think that's why the universe brought it back to you. One on the star, just one. King of Swords, another king. You're going to make the logical head over heart decision because you're still healing. Maybe we need to slow down. It's hard for me to say this, but maybe we need to slow down. One on the seven swords. Eight swords into the nine swords. <laughs> yeah, seven, eight, nine. Oh gosh, I'm being reconsumed by this again. Seven into the eight, nine. Eight into the nine, seven. Wow. Came back to fuck with you, but it came back to fuck with you with, you know, with a purpose. Are you ready to move on? Are you ready to strike this new match? Are you truly ready? Have you healed? Maybe you do need to slow down a little bit. What's this seven of wands reversed about? What's this seven of wands reversed? With the swords. Are you dealing with an air sign? Holy swords. Two swords into the three of swords. 
Somebody's going to feel defeated at the end of the day. Somebody's going to feel heartbroken because somebody has a decision to make. Yeah. But you're making the decision with the clarity of the King of Swords and the clarity of the star and the honesty of the page. Sometimes the Eight of Swords isn't bad. I mean, it can be if you sit there too long. There's like purgatory, prison of my own thoughts, Eight of Swords, and then there's the detox Eight of Swords. <laughs> there's the Knight in the Clink Eight of Swords, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I just need a minute because I have to process through this. As long as you don't go all the way into the nine and put yourself back in here again, you know. I don't see the harm in going into the Eight of Swords every once in a while. As long as you don't stay there. The universe may have brought somebody back as a test, too. Something that didn't work out before. Could have been a failed resurrection. This could be more than the second time you've gone around with this person. Give me one on the two of cups. One on the two of cups. I do see something new coming together at the end of this. Yes, the magician into the high priestess. I see something new coming in. I see something new being manifested that you're letting guided to. But are you ready? One on strength. One on strength. Eight of Wands into the Nine of Wands. Communication. <sighs> Your make or break is the ability to rein it in a little. I think you need to stay in the talking phase before you go full steam ahead. You need to remain guarded before you go full steam ahead. Some of you may not be ready. And I feel like this defeat is for whoever the hell decided to come back to haunt you. Hmm. What a sign. You may have to break a heart. Eight of coins into the nine of coins. Some of you may have some self-work left to do. I, I would encourage you to not go back to the situation that did not grow. I would encourage that. This is a test. This is only a test, water signs. It's only a test. Okay. Can I get a Wisdom Oracle for my water signs, please? A Wisdom Oracle for my water signs. Okay, we'll take two. We'll take two. That's fine. I'm going to set these here for a second. Mending an Orphaned. Oh, boy. Five. Orphaned is number five. Five has changed. Mending is 52. Five plus two is seven. Hmm. Very interesting. Okay, we'll read mending first. Number 52. <coughs> Pardon me. Each time we are hurt and allow the hurt to pass through us without understanding and integration, we accumulate an unwanted burden. 
This keeps us chained to the very things we need to heal. The pain, the memories, the echoes. The echoes of... <clears throat> Sorry. The pain, the memories, the echoes of resentments, and the arguments that we rehearse over and over. Now is the time for mending rifts, healing wounds, and letting go of the old hurts in order to reclaim your power. Now is the time to forgive, to release, to make peace, to make amends, to set yourself free. Water signs. You haven't healed yet. If it comes back, make peace with it. Because if you fail to make peace with it, it's going to carry over. And you just go in the damn vicious cycle. Hmm. Interesting card to have come out for you, water signs. Orphaned, talk to me about number five. What's number five? Oh, goodness. We're all meant to have, we are all meant to have connections with other people within our family, society, and the larger culture. No man is an island, and it's important to recognize when being a part of rather than separate from is essential for your well-being. The issue at hand is the need to find where you fit. Be true to your core truths and values. Perhaps you no longer identify with a group or community the way you did before and need to find a new situation. You might be feeling a deep sense of loss or confusion. Address the need for belonging and know that you will find your place with others of like mind and spirit. It's okay to let go of pressure to fit in. Not everyone will understand you. It's time to move on. I don't know who that was for. If somebody needed it, it's yours. Okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, fire signs. Okay. Let's clean our mess up here. Clean our mess up here. <laughs> this is the fun part. Okay. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is, this deck is stout. Let me tell you, this is the tattoo tarot. This thing is stout. It takes a lot for me to shuffle this baby. Go through it. Oh my goodness. Okay, it wants to talk. Fine. Fine. One more good shuffle. We'll cut it for our fire signs. Aries Leo Sagittarius. why I chose this deck today. This thing kills my hands. Three of coins, five of swords reversed, new foundations being built, coming together. Solid and stable. The challenge is the five of swords reversed. Somebody's pissed off. Could be you. Sense defeat. Okay. It's going to happen this week. Queen of Cups, Eight of Wands reversed, Knight of Coins reversed. Somebody's pulling back. Lack of communication. Somebody's going to pull back. Why is it happening? Because it's supposed to. Wheel of Fortune. This was destined. 
King of Coins reverse Tang Man. Someone stayed hung up on something. That was destined to not work out. Someone may have been left feeling unworthy. Or someone may not have been what they presented themselves to be in a situation. King of Coins reversed. Good clarifier on that. <clears throat> Outcome in the make or break. The devil and three of wands reversed. Ooh, I don't like that devil. I don't like that devil. Fire signs, I'm feeling compelled to say don't fight it. You're on the right path. I feel like you were protected. Your make or break is the ability to walk away from the dock. Bottom of the deck. Strength. Strength holding back. Defeating the beast. You're being protected. Spirit, give me clarity. Spirit, give me clarity. One in the Five of Swords. One in the Five of Swords reversed. High Priestess Empress reversed. Someone's pissed off because something didn't grow. Someone has an ego issue because something didn't come together. Somebody is coming in to try to fuck shit up. And I feel like it's someone who you left feeling defeated. I feel like it's someone who you left feeling unworthy because you knew that they weren't who they said they were. They're hung up. You were being protected. One on this wheel of fortune. One on this wheel of fortune. One on this wheel of fortune. Five of Swords into the Six of Swords. You stood up and did what was right for you and you moved on. Because that's what you were supposed to do. That's what you were compelled to do. And they're ticked off. Your advancement is being challenged, Fire Signs. Someone is challenging your growth. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Talk to me about the Queen of Cups. Talk to me about the Queen of Cups. Thank you, Ace of Coins. Into the Two of Coins. When you love yourself, new good things come to you. Balance comes in. One, two, three. One, two, three. One more. Eight. 
Eight of coins into the nine of coins, working on your independence, loving you, working on you, doing what's best for you. Why the eight of wands reversed? What's happening with the eight of wands reversed? Two of Wands into the Three of Wands, reversed. Stuck. something that you walked away from. It's trying to slow your progress, two of swords into the three of swords. Something you made a decision of what clarity about, something that broke your heart. Eight of wands into the nine of wands. It's in the upright this time. Because they're not going to take your power. You're not going to let it happen. They're going to try. They're going to try, but you're not going to let it happen. Because you've worked too hard. Maybe coming back for communication, coming back for one last go around. I don't think you're going to let it happen. I don't see you letting it happen. What's this Knight of Coins reversed? Talk to me about this Knight of Coins reversed. Two seconds. Sorry. Hate interruptions. Okay, we have the Hierophant into the lovers and the three of swords into the four of swords they still have nothing to offer you and now they have even less and you know it you've learned your lesson with the Hierophant he's a great teacher and you're making a decision three of swords into the four of swords if you gotta break somebody's heart again you gotta break somebody's heart again you know what they're not who they presented themselves to they're the devil they're the devil. They're the devil. I see you making the decision to disconnect and to cut and to heal. Yeah, the connection's there. One more. Three of Wands reversed into the Four of Wands reversed. Let the tower fall. It's not being rebuilt. Leave it on the ground if it's already on the ground. And you're walking away. You're sending them packing. If you're not the one walking, they will be. The make or break is the Three of Wands in the reverse. Keep walking. One on this devil. One on this devil. The magician into the high priest. There's a pull. There is. It's the devil. And the high priestess. There's, there's, a, there's the lovers. This is a strong connection. But it's toxic as fuck. It's toxic. And you know it. You've always known it. They're mad. Because you don't want anything to do with it. 
They're mad because they can't get back in. Because you're wiser. You're smarter. Let him be mad. Let him be mad. You're protected. You're protected by your own wisdom. Five of Wands, Queen of Cups, Ten of Coins, Page of Cups. got to disconnect from this. You're manifesting new things in your life, but you have to disconnect from this. Even if it goes into conflict, five of wands into the six of wands, you will achieve victory. But you got to keep walking. Queen of cups into the king of cups, you have to have that self-love. You have to love yourself enough. And know who is deserving of yours. Ten of coins into the ace of coins. This is a completion. You're starting anew. You're already on your way there. You're already well on your way. Because you loved yourself enough. To know what you wanted and to know what was best for you. Page of cups into the knight of cups. One on that. Nine of coins and the ten of coins. They may try to apologize, but I think you're just going to soon be independent and work on you. Work on getting that tenth coin. You gotta keep walking. You have to disconnect from this toxic bullshit and keep walking because if you don't, you're gonna walk right back into it and you're not gonna achieve what you want. The King of Cups. Knowing who's worthy of your cup. Let's get a wisdom. Can I get a wisdom oracle? A wisdom oracle from a fire signs, please. Wisdom oracle from a fire signs. go time to go <laughs> this is my favorite card it is this is my favorite card it truly is my favorite card <laughs> no, I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie to you um i had someone i was dealing with a little while back i i don't want to i don't want to name drop he may still be a subscriber i don't know but um I kept drawing this card for him. I would ask the Oracle, what do I do? What do I do? Because I was just lost in it. I wasn't sure what to do. Because your intuition gets clouded in situations like that sometimes when you want something so bad. But it's like time to go. Time to go. Time to go. And every time I asked, I got that card. It's like, keep, you know, keep asking. You're going to keep getting the same answer. Yeah, the tarot reader isn't so wise sometimes. Especially when I really want something and the universe keeps telling me no and not giving me a reason. Well, that reason was given to me later when I was able to stomach the clarity that I needed, but neither, neither heard or they were not talking about me. Time to go. You're at the end of one journey and have not yet begun the next. This is the moment to bless your experience thus far. Take stock of what you've learned. It's time to move on to new experiences and a new way of being. There is nothing left for you to do, be, or experience in the present circumstances. Take the risk and move on, even if you need to be in transition for a time. Your destiny is calling you.
what I got for you, fire. Earth. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Really? The moon. Ten of coins reversed. Hmm. Wonder if they're going to come back out. I wonder if they're going to come back out. Dealing with the Pisces, could be dealing with some secrets, lies, and bullshit. Someone could be deceptive about money or where money's going. Why there isn't any, it could be deception in a family situation or deception that is potential to wreck a family. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if they come back out. I could have just dropped them for all I know, but. I felt compelled to share a message. All right, one more from Earth Signs. God, these are some stout cards. Let me tell you. These are some freaking stout cards. Right there. Eight of Coins. Reversed. Devil Reversed. Wasn't that just saying something about money trouble? Some of you could be out of work. I don't know why I'm feeling compelled to say this. If someone's dealing with addiction issues and it's affecting your work, put two and two together. Some of you may be dealing with someone with addiction issues and it's affecting your work. I feel like justice is going to prevail though. Why is it happening? Why is it happening? Ten of swords reversed, three of wands, knight of swords reversed. Hmm. I can tell you're lying when your lips are moving. Yeah. Yeah. If somebody's speaking, or if, I feel like if somebody was speaking or, or saying anything, it was it was lies. If they were speaking at all. Empty promises. Deception and empty promises. Empty promises. Ten of swords reversed. The sun wasn't shining. The sun couldn't shine. There was pain. There was deception. There was lies and it just kept going and it just kept going and someone was waiting and waiting and waiting. I think this week somebody's finally had enough.
What's the outcome? Two of Wands reversed. What's the make or break? Ten of Coins. Okay. Bottom of the deck, the moon reversed. Clarity's coming. Clarity is coming. End of deception. Clarity's coming. Truths are going to be coming out. This has a lot to do with money. Money and toxic bullshit. Great. Mm, gosh. Why my earth signs? You guys are usually really grounded. I, I don't feel like this is I, you dealing with somebody. Could be an air sign. Could be a fire sign. I get the queen of wands. I get the nine of wands. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. That's an earth sign. But I got a lot of air and I got a lot of fire. I got Libra, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Aries, Capricorn. Count my coins here. Hold on. Virgo? Yes, Virgo. The eight and the ten of coins is Virgo. Anyway, anyway, never mind the signs. If it rings a bell, great. If not, don't worry about it. Okay. We want on justice. Need clarity, spirit. We're gonna clarify justice first. That could be someone, uh, someone receiving karma. Could be a legal judgment. The law could be involved in this finally. Maybe that's why truths are coming out. Lovers reversed. Chariot reversed. Yeah. Yeah. Something forcing change. Something forcing you to make a decision that you don't want to make. Did the, did the car stop? Did the car stop? Could... I'm... <laughs> Okay, this is getting real specific real quick. I'm hearing drunk driving. I'm hearing drunk driving. Okay. Eight of swords reversed, ten of swords reversed. Finally getting out of your head. Finally an end of the sleepless night. Someone finally got caught. Okay. Whoa. Why the Queen of Wands? King of Wands reversed. Double reversed. Knows what she wants, goes after it, and nothing gets in her way. One in the King of Wands reversed. Nine of coins to the ten of coins, fool to the magician. Oh, 
Huh. Somebody's got fire in their chart. This could this could be leading to divorce. Queen of Wands, King of Wands reverse. This could be like, okay, you know what? I'm done with your shit. Get out. I've had enough of your shit. Get out. King of Wands into the Page of Wands both reversed. I've had enough of your shit. Get out. I've had enough of your childish bullshit. Get out. Your toxic childish bullshit. I'm going off. I'm starting something new. I'm doing what's best for me. I'm flying solo. I'm disconnecting from this. I think this ended up costing somebody some money. Mm. This made someone have to miss work. Page of Wands reversed into the Knight of Wands. Something came to a dead stop. No communication. Something came to a dead stop. You are separating from something toxic. Nine of Wands. Why the Nine of Wands? Eight of Coins reversed into the Nine of Coins reversed. I'm here and locking somebody out from bank accounts. Knight of Swords reversed into the Queen of Swords reversed. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know. This got super specific super quickly. I apologize if this isn't resonating with many of you, but somebody needs this. It's all going down this week. If it hasn't already gone down. Why the two of wands reversed for the outcome? I don't like that. Because I feel like you wait at the crossroads not really knowing what to do. Six of wands reversed, seven of wands reversed. King of Swords. To make a logical one, not an emotional one, you have to leave it with your head, not your heart. Some of you may well go into hiding. But you have to make a decision. You have to decide if you leave somebody behind or not. But you can't lead with your heart. You have to leave with your head. This is toxic as fuck. I think whoever you're dealing with needs more help than you can give them. I think you've tried and you've tried and you've tried and you've failed. Being someone 19 years clean, it's a path I've walked. They have to be willing to walk it. It's ha it has to be something they want to do. You can't force someone to go to rehab. You can't force someone to go to AA. Because if you force it, it's not going to work. It's something they have to want. Why the Ten of Coins for the make or break? Ten of Coins reversed. This is to do with money. I'm hearing, I don't know how I'm going to do this without them. I don't know how I'm going to do this alone. You're going to do it. That's how you're going to do it. You're just going to do it. That's how you're going to do it. One more. You're just going to do it. Seven of Cups into the Eight of Cups. There's going to be confusion and possibly a return. 
one more. Not taking all those. But I'm going to take the world reversed. Because that only confirms the coming back around to stir up shit. Maybe these are events that have already occurred. And someone's coming back to stir up shit. Queen of Wands upright. You're just going to do it. Decide what you want. Do you want peace and serenity or do you want toxicity? If you're harnessing this Queen of Wands energy, the king better be coming back right. He better not be coming back as a page. Three of coins reversed. And then four of coins reversed. They go come back, they go come back right, and they don't come back. You want to come back and reunite? Fine. Otherwise, I'm just going to let your ass go. I think y'all need a couple of messages from the Oracle. All right, I'm going to do an Oracle message, and I'm going to do a protection message. Can I get an Oracle message? Can I do an Oracle message? Observer. All right, one for protection, one for protection. Mending, oh wow, okay. Number 49, four plus nine is 13, one plus three is four, four is the number of stability. Number 49, observer. Most people see the world through a personal lens. They closely identify with their feelings and experiences so much so that they come to believe that these are the only reality. There are times when you need distance in order to gain perspective and understand your circumstances from a more neutral vantage point. Now is one of those times in your life. This is a perfect moment for you to begin to do some exploring. Instead of only considering yourself, consider what you need to understand about the conditions, people, culture, and environment you're engaged with now. We'll be so happy that you did. Illumination is a miracle you seek and will indeed find. Do you want to stay around this? You've been given an opportunity to take a step back. And observe. How does it look on the outside looking in? How does it look? Is this something you want to go back to? You gotta ask yourself that. 52. 5 plus 2 is 7. Alright. Mending, mending, mending. The protection message for mending. Heartbreak is a strange healer of souls. Our grief strips away our masks and loosens our tight hold on our separateness. Where we view ourselves as I and the world as it. Loss allows us to see ourselves as part of a larger scheme. Opening us up to sympathy, empathy, dependence on others. In the moment when we can't hold ourselves together. And it leads us to become one of the greater whole again. Pain and suffering is a part of life, and none of us are none of us will be immune to it. Can you view this loss, this pain, this dissonance as a way back to source? Let your sorrow break your heart wide open. You will never be left behind. You are loved now more than ever by spirit who does not want you to feel alone. 
one day you will look back and know this truth. Wow. Wow. What did I say? What did I say? I don't know how I'm going to do this by myself, but I'm just going to do it. Yes, you are going to do it because you're being protected. You are loved. Spirit and source is with you. You are not alone. You are not alone. You're not alone. Whew, I'm getting misty. Okay, we're moving to the air signs. Okay. Oh. Wow. Said, I'm sorry that got so specific, but it was for someone and someone needed it. So, we're going to go with it. And trust me, in um, the first few years after I got clean, some of the people I dealt with and some of the connections that I dealt with, um, it was hard to walk away, but I had to walk away from me because I was hell bent on never going back down that road again. And I was hell bent on not being dragged back down that road again. And it's hard to walk away from someone you love. It is. But for self-preservation, sometimes you got to walk away. And if they come back and they come back clean, okay. They come back right, okay. But never sacrifice your own sobriety or risk that for anybody. Okay. Air signs. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Six coins reversed. Some ain't fair. Something is not equal give and take. Someone is putting in more effort and energy than the other person. And the challenge is the Knight of Swords speaking truth. <laughs> Saying something, okay. Tower reversed. Devil reversed. Nine of Wands reversed. The rebuilding in the tower, the disconnecting from toxic energy, and the throwing in of the towel. Okay. Huh. Huh. Oh, shoot. Why is it happening? Why is it happening? Strength. Two of Wands reversed. And the King of Swords. Holding back. Being at the crossroads, making a logical head over heart decision. Huh. Huh. The rebuilding of the tower. The rebuilding of the tower. You went back to something. Somebody went back to something. Somebody went back to something they held back from. Something they already cut out once out of self-preservation. And now some of you are learning a lesson the second time around. And your challenge is speaking truth. What's the outcome? Nine of Cups reversed. Make or break is the page of wands. Okay. Bottom of the deck is the three of coins, the building of foundations. Maybe you may have to, I don't know, I don't know, oh wow. This is getting weird. This just officially got weird, okay.
Why the tower? Why the tower? King of Swords. Nine of Cups. Oh, wow. So you're trying again. I need one of that Nine of Cups reversed. Are you trying again because you're miserable and you're not happy? Are you trying again because it's the logical thing to do? Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands, Five of Cups, Six of Cups. Good God. You're giving it one last go because you're sad. You're taking on the burden. You're trying to rebuild this tower and taking on the burden because you're sad. That's why. Something you already cut out once. Oh my gosh, air signs, why? You know it's not equal give and take. You know you're going to invest more than you're going to give back. Why are you doing this? Sadness, loneliness, despair. Maybe we should try again. You're making a non-emotional decision based on emotion. That doesn't even fucking make sense. I'm hearing and feeling it's better than being alone. I'll take this burden back on because it's better than being alone. Wow. Really? Really? Wow. Okay. Well, why the devil reversed? Why the devil reversed? No judgment here. I mean, I've done it. I'm not going to judge. I stayed in a codependent relationship for years after it ended. <laughs> Just because it was better than going home to an empty house every night. I mean... And then something becomes so toxic that you embrace the empty house and the quiet when you come home to it at night. The star. The star into the moon. Okay, so... In all appearances, someone seems to have disconnected from their toxic bullshit and the healing is taking place, but there's that moon card. There's still an air of mystery. There's still an air of deception. One more. Ten of Wands reversed into the Ace of Wands reversed. The burden's still there. The burden is still there. The burden has not been released. Someone still may still be engaging in toxic shit. Okay. And keeping it from you. Why the Nine of Wands reversed? I feel like you end up throwing in the towel again at the end of the week. Ten of Swords reversed. Ace of Swords. Or maybe not. Maybe you're avoiding the end of a painful cycle. Because you don't want to start over. Six of Swords reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. This could be contemplating the return. King of Cups reversed. Ah, uh, I think the floodgates open. The floodgates are going to end up opening for someone. I think somebody's going to be bringing up stuff that happened a while ago. Could be some childish energy coming into. Just a emotional vomit. I don't know on whose part though. 
truths are going to be spoken, though. Someone trying to throw in the towel. Truths being spoken. Someone trying to lie their way out of something and then co confessing with the truth. Because they know you ain't having it. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm going to leave that alone. Give me one on this Nine of Cups reversed. Charming trickster. The burned ego. Somebody leaves very upset. One more. One more. They may try to manipulate their way back in just because they're wounded and Hereford reverse, lovers reverse. No, <laughs> you like no, <laughs> no, because you didn't learn your lesson the first time, and apparently neither did I. Eight of swords reverse, nine of swords reversed. I want to sleep better at night. I want out of my cage. I'd rather be sad and alone than sad and with someone. <laughs> no, wow. I can't believe I just said that, but that's that's what I'm feeling compelled to say. I'd rather be sad and alone than sad and with someone. I'd rather be alone and unfulfilled than with someone and unfulfilled. They're the charming trickster. Their ego has been burned. I think you both end up sad and alone, but but I don't think that's such a bad thing for you because at least you're sleeping at night and you're not trapped in a cage your own thoughts about it. Why the Navel Wands? The Navel Wands is trudging down a path. It's supposed to take you. Knight of Cups reversed, Queen of Cups reversed. Whether you cannot get all up in your emotions about it. Two of coins reversed, three of coins reversed. You know something is an equal. You've already done been, you've already done this before. I don't even know why you're re-engaging with him. And I know you I know why you're re-engaging with it because you don't want to be alone. I see this not coming together. I th see you trudging down your path. Knight of Wands into the Queen of Wands. I want what I want and I'm going to get what I want and I'm taking the steps to get what I want. It's the maturing emotionally and the maturing in your actions. It's taking the steps. Wow. Y'all need a protection message too. <laughs> I mean... Air signs, I love y'all, but some y'all need protection from yourselves right now. I feel like somebody out there is horrible decision, horrible decision. I mean, I I, I don't try not to judge anybody else's path, but I feel like someone is walking into a situation that they know isn't going to be fair and equal, and their challenge is going to be standing up and speaking their truth and establishing what and what they're not going to put up with again. if you're going to rebuild a tower with someone on the basis of they've cleaned up their act and then you find out that they haven't cleaned up their act. Maybe you should have figured that out the first time around. Milk and honey. 51. Can I get a protection message, please? Both 
building blocks. Okay. Why on earth did it give you milk and honey? Okay. You've entered a sweet time in your life, enjoying the land of milk and honey that everyone wants to experience. It's an interlude that feels more... I, I can't pronounce this word. I feel like such a jerk right now. Languid than ambitious? When all your senses are awake and unlimited possibilities in the universe, are awake to unlimited possibilities in the universe, these times are precious and can only come when you're in your authentic zone, wearing the world as a loose garment, not wanting yet to, I'm sorry, what? Not wanting yet able to be nourished in ways both tangible and suitable and subtle. Abundance is an energy that you are living. Okay, what? Say what? I'm pulling another card for y'all. I'm pulling another card for y'all. Or 44. I just don't feel like that's the oracle message. Number 44. The ability to reason and strategize is the focus now. Take things at face value and follow logical path. Your calculations will prove to be correct. For in this moment, there is no deeper meaning than what is obvious. Things are exactly as they seem. You have all the information you need. Keep it simple and you will win the game of life you're playing right now. Okay. Number 28. Then I will reread 51, even I don't know what that has to do with anything. I'm not seeing anybody in the land of milk and honey in this scenario right now. I'm sorry, I'm just not. If I look like a jerk, that that's fine. Protection message for 28. Now is, now is the time to address the cracks and the foundations of your life. Perhaps your values have changed and it is time to strengthen your convictions and let go of things that no longer serve the vision you have for your life. Or perhaps you choose to ignore the signs a situation or agreement you have entered into is not right for you. 
Remove the rotten pieces and reinforce your core moral strength and integrity. Now is the time for rigorous honesty. For you are called to renovate and upgrade your consciousness. You will be so happy when you do. Spirit has a spectacular br blueprint for your life far beyond your imagination. Don't be afraid to replace what's not solid. Okay. Now I'm going to read Milk and Honey. I don't know why I struggled to read that. It's just like, wait a minute, this is not making sense. Okay. Try this again. You've entered a sweet time in your life, enjoying the land of milk and honey that everyone wants to experience. It's an interlude that feels more languid than ambitious when all your senses are awake to the unlimited possibilities in the universe. These times are precious and only come when you're in your authentic zone, wearing the world as a loose garment, not wanting yet to be nourished in ways, not wanting yet able to be nourished in ways both tangible and subtle. Abundance is an energy that you are a living part of. All your needs are being met. You're given the gift of nourishment in every form. That was for somebody, apparently. I apologize. I struggled with it the first time. Okay, guys. I might just be getting tired and spent. So, it's cool. Know that you love to be blessed. I gotta, like, get this uploaded before I gotta go to the bread and butter job. So, air signs. You might get a bonus weekly tomorrow. We'll see how I'm feeling in the morning um, before I gotta take my car to the garage. So, know that you love to be blessed. I'll catch you later.